It's been a terrible year for Bangladesh as the country has experienced a surge in militant activities. Attacks on Shia mosques and other religious minorities have raised a sense of insecurity among many Bangladeshis. The so-called Islamic State has reportedly claimed responsibility of attacks. Bangladesh's president insists militancy will not take a deep root in the country. This is very unwanted. Bangladesh is a land for all religion. Secularism is one of the main pillars of Bangladesh. The country was moving forward on the basis of secularism. Attacks on mosques and temples are very unfortunate. Many Muslim-majority countries like Afghanistan, Pakistan and Iraq are passing through unrest for a long time. Unrest in those countries might affect Bangladesh as a Muslim-majority country. Besides, foreign powers might have a role to instigate militancy in Bangladesh. Bangladesh is predominantly a Sunni-majority country with over 160 million people. Different branches of Islam and other religions have coexisted here peacefully. But radical Islamic groups have become active in Bangladesh. Five bloggers were killed this year, but no one has been punished over these crimes. Many analysts believe that local radical groups have some sort of interconnection with Pakistan and Middle East-based militant groups. Bangladesh's president believes that the country will come out of the situation. I believe most of the Bangladeshis don't believe in attacking other religion. Some people are trying to destabilize the country. But I firmly believe that Bangladesh will never face militancy like Pakistan and Afghanistan. We are dealing with the matter strongly. Only security forces are not enough to deal with militancy. We are trying to create awareness against militancy among common people so that they can create resistance against militants. We must protect Bangladesh's secularism. Bangladesh. Bangladesh's security forces continue their crackdown on suspected militants. More than 100 suspected Islamic militants were rounded up. But the attacks and threats on bloggers, Christian priests and mosques never stopped. Many analysts believe that security forces must improve their tactics to fight against militancy in Bangladesh. Akbar Hussain, BBC News, Dhaka.